I'm gonna let your sister have a little bit. You've had loads. And I think your mother is beginning to not like your sister. So we're gonna let your sister have some. You can go to the other side. You can go to the other side. There we go. No, go to the other side. You're stepping, oh God. You're stepping all over. Let's see, I think she's. Come here. Come on. She's beginning to reject yo lamb, which is not great. Yo lamb was calling and calling and calling, so I came in and realized it was hungry. That's because you're beating it up. Look at that. She's just not sure it's hers, even though it is. One. Nope. You've been having lots of mother's TLC. Your sister hasn't. Yes. Sweet boy. Look at that. All that mother love. And she hasn't been giving it to the daughter. Go on. You want to go under there a bit more? There you go. No, you're not going to compete with your daughter, right? Your sister, right now. Where's the teeth? Gone. There we go. There it is. There it is. Oh, there we go. beginning to be the violence of rejection. But your belly's getting nice and full. Yeah. Born this morning and she's still damp because her mother didn't want to clean her. You are a B-I-T-C-H. Yep. Definitely. Look, she's like biting at the lamb. But I'm sitting here, so she doesn't quite reject it fully. I'll just have to keep an eye at it on you as well. Yeah. She is not being nice to it. See, that's a mother that likes its young, nuzzles the arse end, but she's battering the arse end of the yellow lamb. I'm going to keep you from doing that. Oh, jeez. Ow! And she walked all over me. And she knocked the poor yellow lamb down. Yeah, she's rejecting it and kicking it now. Oh, God, this is just what I need right now. The frustrations of nature doing its thing, but 
not in the right way. So everybody thinks a yo should naturally be mothery to both of its twins that it gave birth to. It's now kicking this yo lamb. You were just being plain unpleasant. See how humpy she is versus him. He's not humpy at all. <laughs> Come on. There you go. There we go. Get in there. And she's an experienced mother. That's what makes this all the more frustrating and annoying. She's a many years experienced yo, and she's rejecting one of her lambs. Really, really frustrating, I can't tell you. You're used to it with a hog occasionally, but not with a yo. Look at her, biting the tail. Trying to prevent it from nursing by reversing. Look at that. So I have the lamb that she wants. I'm leaving her with the lamb she doesn't want. And she won't let that one suckle. She's completely, yeah. She hasn't started beating it up yet. Quite. She's beginning to. She's stressing because she doesn't know where her, her lamb is. Because I have it above her sight line and smell line. I'm doing this to see if she'll let the other one nurse. But she obviously won't. There 
There we go. You found it finally because it spoke. Still have this one. Ink is over there in the hay bale watching. You see in the round bale? Oh, this is so frustrating. Hopefully, the yo lamb will pass some of the milk it suckled now, and uh, she'll accept it, hopefully. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I might just have to come back a few times and do this. Take the male lamb so that she can smell that the other lamb is hers. Other end, sweetie. Oh, there we go. That end. Sideways and in. See, very subtly, she kicks the lamb away from suckling. She's a no, she might know it's kind of hers, but doesn't want it. Come on, latch on. See, it, her ears are still wet from this morning because her mother hasn't licked her dry. Come on. Go in there. Now, get that. It's right there. Sometimes it's just easier to flip the yo. So I flipped her onto her back, onto her hips, and the lamb is now suckling. There she is suckling. Got her lying between her legs and suckling. So this way I know she's gonna get a, go a good gulp of colostrum. Still sucking? Yeah, you're still interested. Come on. Come on. No, no, if you stand up, you won't have the right angle. Come on. There we go. There we go. Good girl. Good 
Good girl. This is the other lambs trying to get in on the act. But he's got a lovely full belly. Loads of colostrum. Yep. Well, I think you've got a fuller belly now. That's a good shake. That's a good sign. Good girl. Yeah. Good girl. Okay, I'll get you out of the way while I roll her back over. Yeah, you go there. And you go with your brother over there. Go on. Out of girl. Now. There we go. Whew. That, Becky, is a huge mass of yo. Uh, there we go. Well, if you don't cooperate, I'll have to make you kind of cooperate. So, I'll come out later and see how um, this lamb is doing. Here you go. Your mom is calling. Put the female there first. There. Do some trickery pokery. Picked up the male. Let's see if this works. She will just lie there with that one there, as long as the one in my arms stays quiet. See, she's still a bit hungry. Well, she figured out where it was. Well, the good thing is she's not totally beating it up. So there's hope. Oh, well, maybe I spoke too soon. <laughs> Uh, I think I spoke too soon. You're very sweet, but your mother is acting the maggot. Yeah. Yeah, you. You're acting the absolute maggot. Rejecting little top knot there. At least top knot has had some food. <laughs> Yep. Keeps rejecting her. Well, she's had food. So I'm going to go and come back again. And hopefully 
she won't have rejected it more. so annoying how sheep can do this and there is nothing nothing wrong with that lamb she's just deciding she doesn't want it so she's now accepting them she's slightly ferocious on that yo lamb but she's accepting them now Hopefully, hopefully the problem is solved with a little bit of mental manipulation, taking the ram lamb out for periods of time. Anyway, the whole time I've been doing this, faithful hound Inca has been sitting here in the ring feeder, lovely and cozy and dry, haven't you? And over here, Mustard has been curled up in the straw as well. Isn't that right, kitty? You're beautiful, kitty. You're so beautiful. Oh, you're so beautiful. Yes, you're so beautiful.